thank you. Uh, which takes us to item 12. Just make sure, doubly check that I've got that right. Um, and this time it is the allocation of the Waste Minimization and Innovation Fund. More fun stuff and happening out there in the community. And I'd like to invite um, Sarah Leclerc to present on this item and to share her screen and just to int introduce the team that have been involved in this mahi, also a very substantial um, amount of work. Kia ora, Sarah. Kia ora. I'm just checking that you can see my slides. Yes, looking good, thank you. Ah, fantastic. So, uh, tēnā koto, tēnā koto, tēnā koto katoa, e mihi ana ki nā mana whanua, huri noa a uh, Tamaki Mokoro, ko Sarah Leclerc tōku ingoa, no Tamaki Mokoro aho. E Mahiana o he Waste Party Manager mo te tare o Waste Solutions. No rera, tēnā koto katoa. Um, I'm, I'm, jo Kia ora. Um, I'm joined by um, Elizabeth Driver, um, who has done most of the work on um, uh, managing this fund this year. Um, I don't know if Elizabeth, you want to introduce yourself? Thanks, Sarah. Uh, tēnā koto, tēnā koto, tēnā koto katoa. Uh, e mihi ana. Ki nga mana whenua huri noa o Tāmaki Makoro, ko Elizabeth Driver, tōku ingoa, nō reira, tēnā koutou, katoa. Um, uh, the other person I'd also like to introduce who's um, online but picking up her son at the moment so um, can't introduce herself uh, is Tanya Brown. Tanya has taken over from Sam um, who is on um, the usual post holder and who you usually hear from but is on um, loan to MFE at the moment as are a few of council staff I know. So um, with that we just um, most of our item is um, under the confidential item this, um, this item is normally heard under confidential um, so we just wanted to um, briefly give an overview of the fund um, we um, but we would then suggest that our presentation uh, the item has stopped here we go let's go again um, is that working now? All good, thank you. All good. Um, so just to remind members that the waste um, waste fund is um, as half a million dollars that we get to an, um, allocate annually. That's funded from the national waste levy, um, and it provides seed funding um, for businesses, schools, uh, Maori and community organisations and projects, and um, and it um, aims to meet the. Um, for promoting and achieving waste minimization activities as set out in the um, the waste plan. Um, it encourages New Zealanders to take responsibility for their waste and creates great funding opportunities for those waste minimization initiatives and um, and we see a lot of those ones that we seed fund through this initiative go on to win things like the Zero Waste Awards so we know it's doing great things out there in, in the community. Um, the, um, the We have a, a presentation that is um, itemised as confidential um, Madam Chair, so uh, do you want us to um, continue in that mode or should we, um, there's sort of a, the open and closed agenda, just double checking the procedure which you prefer and more comfortable with. I'll take Thank advice you, Sarah. on that. Thank you, Megan. Sorry, it's Megan here. Thank you, Sarah. Appreciate that. Um, look, you do have two reports on this matter. One is um, effectively an open report, as Sarah said, a, a general one, but the, the content that you really need to discuss uh, and decide on is in confidential. So the, the open report has two noting recommendations. Can I suggest, Madam Chair, that we stop it here? You've, you've heard the, the general um, update from Sarah. Um, can I suggest you, you move second and make a decision on the open and then close to go into confidential uh, where you'll make decisions um, on the actual applications themselves? Thanks. And, and have the presentation in confidential. That's correct. Yes, yeah. that's right. Thanks. I'm comfortable with that. Um, so I have a partai. So Councillor Walker, having heard that explanation, so it's just on the the fund itself rather than the allocation. Do you, is your partai about the fund? Yes, it's about the fund. Okay, if you'd like to ask a question. So I've, uh, I've just got a question around the um, evaluation um, criteria. Um, is, is there a uh, criteria um, 
uh, around reduction in um, carbon emissions? Uh, through the chair, we don't have a specific um, carbon emissions reduction um, criteria at present. We focus on um, waste minimization, recognizing that um, carbon emissions reduction can, can be part of that. Do you um, propose to have a an emissions reduction target in line with the necessity for us to reduce um, emissions as part of our climate plan? Um, in considering um, applications for all this, we target specific waste streams, um, and those to, and to reduce. Um, and one of the targets is to reduce um, the, the, those waste streams going to landfill. Um, and if one of the waste streams this year was um, organic waste and uh, food waste in particular, and and within that is then um, um, the ability to um, reduce waste, to reduce our carbon emissions. Thank you, and it's the good um, full climate impact statement there on the report as well. So, so I have a partai from um, Councillor Cooper. Kia ora, Linda. Thank you, Madam Chair. It's following on from Councillor Walker's question. Um, can I just have a clarification who sets the criteria? Does that come from MFE because the Waste Minimisation Fund is funded from the levy and MFE, do we have to follow that or are we, um, as suggested, making up our own rules as we go along? Uh, through the Chair, we the aim of the um, money that goes to territorial th authorities is promoting or achieving the activities set out in our waste plan. So the fund is to um, provide seed funding for um, for those organisations to be able to do that to help deliver the waste plan, and those are um, and the, those activities are set out within that plan. Thank, thank you. So it's about waste minimisation. Thank you. Thank you for that clarification, um, Member Wilson. Your partai. Uh, similar to. Oh, thank you for the presentation. Uh, Aroha mai Sarah. Um, I'm just wanting to know. The a question that I posed previously and was there any targeted promotion of the grant program to Manafinua and Matawaka? Um, for this round, um, as com this committee heard earlier in the year, we have changed the, um, uh, we updated the criteria and the um, the principles of the fund to try and improve. Um, um, uh, outcomes for Maori. Um, there was a targeted. Um, there were three workshops that were that took place to promote the fund, um, and for this year, um, recognising that we need to do more, we have within Waste Solutions um, KPIs um, for specific capacity building workshops specifically targeted at Māori organisations, um, and we are in conversation at the moment as to how best to do that, um, and looking at um, working with our community partners and with um, specific. Um, organisations who are embedded in Māori communities who will be best placed to do that um, and then to offer that additional assistance. So recognising this part of an ongoing journey to improve Māori outcomes um, as stated in the report. Thank you, Sarah. I know there's a lot of work going on there. I guess I just meant opening up the ability to um, promote wider than the the methods currently used, so you are getting a wide range. Absolutely, and we are strongly um, uh, committed to to improving that um, and making sure that we aim to not just reach, but uh, you know, um, exceed our target of 15% of funds going to um, Maori organisations um, uh, or those that achieve Maori outcomes um, in the in subsequent rounds. Haven't quite achieved it this year, but we hope we you know we plan to. But have genuine capacity and capability and um, building um, through those uh, the minimum of four workshops, let's say, which is our and that's our minimum of KPI within our I waste solutions that. business plan. I noted that, and, and I, I should have said between 55 and 56 powers, 55 and 56, you've outlined that really well. So, uh, kudos to you all. Oh. Kudos, thank you for that feedback. Um, I've got a mover for this item. Um, Councillor Simpson, do I have a seconder? Alf, second. Um, Atua, Alf, thank you. 
Um, if there's no um, comments, I will put that um, that we note a noting. Well, I'll put the motion. <laughs> All those in favour? Aye. 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 To the contrary. No, carried. Thank you, everybody, and um, I won't give my um, thanks yet to Sarah because we're going to see her again in the confidential item. Um, so we'll wait till till we get there. Um, we just got the item 13, the summary of Environment and Climate Change Committee information memoranda and briefings. So I will uh, move that. Do I have a seconder? Collins. Thank you, Councillor Collins. I'll put that. All those in favour? Aye. Say aye. 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 To aye. the contrary? No. Kumana carried. Which brings us on to the or well, item 14. Um, there's been a request for a consideration of extraordinary item that is out of timing. So aye. and not able to be received onto this agenda um, but we will get an update after the confidential item so we're going to now move the procedural motion to exclude the public do I have a seconder Dalton thank we you councillor Dalton so this is so that we can um, agree the allocation of the waste minimization innovation fund in confidential um, I will put that all those in favour say aye. 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 To the contrary, aye. no, uh, um, Sipa, carried. I want to speak to your motion. If you um, look at the timing, sorry. it was before you put your motion. Um, well, I've just put this one, so I'm just going to finish putting item 15. All those in favour, I think I've done that, so carried. Um. Member Fletcher, I've ruled that there's no extraordinary item that can be brought to this meeting because it wasn't received um, within the standing orders. So it's been agreed well, the that we wasn't cut down inside sorry, the standing sorry, orders. Sorry, 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 Member Point Fletcher. Order, Madam Member Chair. Fletcher, Member Fletcher, you've been given an opportunity that we are going to get an update from Megan after the confidential item. Um, so we either do it then or not at all. Madam so Chair, can I, point I, of I order, don't Madam Chair. Be, sorry, anyway, I've got, I've got a, order, Madam excuse Chair. me, Scary, I've got a point of order, Councillor Casey. I think you've ruled on this. Can we move into the confidential item, please? Thank you. So on that basis, um, we are going to take um, we're going to stay on this line, and so don't sign out of this line. We're going to come back into confidential. So Ward is going to check that everybody who's meant to leave the call. Um, leaves us. Thank you everybody who's been part of this meeting um, till now. We are now moving into confidential. Everyone's got two minutes for a quick um, loo break and we will be back for the confidential item at 3.31. Thank you and thank you for everybody who supported the meeting up to now who are leaving us. Um, ka kite.